Khaleesi plays Invincible Persons Atomic Eve Part 9. Previously on this game, we had a chat with a prisoner named Universal. Uh, she wanted us to collect her staff. Um, when we went to go hunting for the staff, we ran into our ex-boyfriend Rex. He said we were... Uh, ever since the breakup, we've changed and we were going down a dark spiral. And when we tried to leave, he wanted to fight us. So we punched him in the face for cheating on us. And then we kicked his butt and then we left. And then we have good news that our friend Mark is out of the hospital. All right. Episode 9, Prisoner Dilemma. Let's go. Let's start. I hold the staff in my hands, pull heavy me metallic. Only Universal can wield it. I'm considering what to do next when my phone buzzes with a message. Home from hospital. Mark, you're alive. New phone, who dis? <laughs> Mark! Eve! Trapped at home, so bored. Please help save me from my mother's smoothies. On my way. I rush to Mark's house as fast as I've ever hurried anywhere. Okay, maybe faster. I just need to see he's okay. I really needed his advice. I just need to see he's okay. His mom answers the door. Oh, hi. She looks really drained and tired, almost like she was in an accident herself. Miss Grayson, if you're here to see Mark, he's resting. Oh. Mark calls from the couch. Uh, I'm over here. She walks off quietly. Mark sits up. Oh. Oh, Mark, don't strain yourself. How bad does it hurt? Um, don't strain your, yourself. He waves it off. Don't worry about it. That was a decorative oh no really is it bad you don't have to put on a brave face uh no really is it bad i'm just sore not hurting painkillers are doing their thing he subconsciously massages his arm i try to assess how decorative he's really feeling he looks better than i was expecting sad actually um better than i was expecting he heals even faster than I do. I guess Robot wasn't kidding about the GDA state-of-the-art hospital. But he's obviously not ready to fight crime just yet. Eve! He takes my hand. You look worried. Don't! It's okay. I'm okay. He gives my hand a squeeze. Before letting go, it feels... Moving, why he's worried about my feelings, tingling, is there a spark here? Reassuring, it's good to have my friend back, considering his grip is not as strong as I remember. Well, since he broke up with Amber, maybe there's a spark here. Last time we hung out, we were both dating other people, but now we're both available. Now he's healing from almost dying and having his world torn in half. What am I doing? Do I have feelings for Mark? Yeah, I do. No, really. Just want to be friends. Yes, we do. He half smiles. I'll get out of there again soon. I know I have to. I kind of miss flying. I know I haven't even been doing it that long, but it feels like the one thing I'm not. He trails off. And I'm craving a burger. The GDA has all the cash in the world for tech, but their cafe food still sucks. His mom drifts in, looking for something. Burgers? Mark, you know you're not supposed to. <sighs> I just don't have the energy. She leaves with it without finding what she came in for. Mark looks guilty. Did I say burgers? I'm sure I meant smoothies. Healthy, cold, wet, green smoothies. 
Is she okay? Do you want a smoothie? Do you want a burger? He leans close, checks to make sure we're alone, then whispers. Are you serious? I never joke about burgers. <laughs> okay, well, if you don't want one, I never joke about burgers. I can't believe I get to witness this. He tenses in anticipation. Oh, that's right, you can make stuff out of nothing. Okay, here goes. I take a magazine from the coffee table, fan open the pages, and without making a sound, transform it into a burger. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. Seriously, why does nobody talk about this? I want to turn a magazine into a burger. I hope no one was reading that. The burger hovers in the air for a moment. It's like the burger of angels. Uh, Mark looks at his burger like he wants to marry it. I hope you don't mind. I'm going to devour this in three bites. Go for it. I look at one of my plate, plate? Oh, one on my plate, veggie patty, curly lettuce, fresh tomato. Not bad. Mark finishes eating and relaxes. Eve, you're incredible. Thank you. It's true. Why are we thanking him? Oh, uh, thank, thank, I guess, thank you? We fall quiet for a, a minute after eating. Is it okay if I ask you something about the fight? Yeah, I knew you'd have questions. It'd be weird if you didn't. Okay, but only if you want to answer. I, wa I want to. It's good to talk about it. it. makes it more in the past somehow. Okay. Uh, where's your dad now? What started the fight? Are you and your mom safe? Has your dad ever hurt you before? Uh, yeah, has your dad ever hurt you before? No. He was like a normal dad, mostly. Okay, was his dad like possessed? And in this kind of world, somebody could just look like the person, you know? Uh, are you and your mom safe? Yeah, the GDA has, like, the best secret hospital money can buy. And they basically have the house in a protective bubble now. The only thing is, they're going to want me to step up and protect Earth like he did. But I don't know if I'm ready. And I don't know what made him snap. Is it in me, too? Like, what if... What if I'm just like him? Oh, Mark, you're not. You chose, choose how do you behave. But I'm still not really sure that's his dad. Like, you can get possessed in this world. I'm sure, you know, people can make it look like you're one person when you're somebody else. But uh, I'm going to say you choose how to behave. I know, it's just that then it means that he didn't just snap. He chose it. Oh, maybe that was a bad choice. Yeah. I'm sorry. Where's your dad now? Uh, where's your dad now? We actually don't know. He left the planet. The GDA knows that much. Left the planet? Yeah, I can't remember how much of this I told you before, but since it might be important now... He's not from Earth. His, his dad was an alien? So maybe he went back to his own planet. Maybe he went somewhere else. Mark, are you telling me you're half alien? Uh, can you fly right off the planet? Is he going to come back? Are you half alien, dude? Technically half Korean American? Alien Korean American. And he, he is all for true But now, if he ever comes back... I might be the only thing strong enough to defend against him. You just have that hanging over your head. We have to be ready for anything. That's why they're giving me extra training and support. As soon as I'm healed enough, that's a lot of pressure. I'm glad you have the support. Wasn't the GDA working with Omni Man before? Uh, yeah, this one. Yeah, I guess he had them fooled too. I'm still, I, come on, you guys, like, we still don't know for sure that's, that was really your dad fighting you, you know? Uh, what started the fight? He didn't want to protect Earth. He wanted to subjugate it. 
obviously I couldn't let him do that. But he's much stronger than me. The only reason I'm alive is he decided not to kill me. Okay, so maybe he's possessed by something, you know, like something's trying to control him. And he, what little of his father that was inside of him protected his son. But like something is like trying to take him over. The thing about my dad is I still love him. I just wish I could talk to him. Is that ridiculous? No, he is your dad. I'd want him to stay far away as possible. Uh, no, he's your dad. You'll probably always want to talk to him. I still have so many things I wish I could say to my birth family. And I barely knew them. Wait, those parents that we've been playing this whole game with aren't really her parents? They're adopted parents? And some of them tried to kill me. I guess we have that in common now. So romantic. We get along for a reason. I wish we didn't. I guess we get along for a reason. This isn't my favorite reason, but yeah. He gives my hand another squeeze. We're talking about me too much. Tell me about you. What's going on? A lot has happened while you were out. I hung out with Emma and William. I kind of tried to fight Rex. We've been the... Oh, um... Tell about my ex or... Uh, universe. We'll go with Universal. Uh, there's been developments in the Universal story. She's that alien you battled and we fixed up that neighborhood, right? That's the one. Remember how we found Kill Cannon's boot print? Yeah. I feel a moon about finding the staff, robot, and the GDA. So Cecile wants to capture the staff to save Earth? And Universal needs the staff and at least enough energy to keep her people alive until they find a permanent, a permanent source. What you agreed is not Earth. Correct. So do you trust her? Uh, yes, maybe. No. Uh, I don't know. I know she's telling the truth about her planet. Her people are starving. I can see it in her eyes how, how hard she's fighting for them. But if you give her the power she, she wants, what will she do to us once she has it? Do you think she'll turn on us? Of course, we can't know. I believe we can fend ourselves. We, do we have to assume she'll attack? Uh, we can't really know. Are we just keeping her jail, jailed because we're afraid? That's a rhetorical question. I can see why Cecile would be cautious, but I'm not convinced. I don't trust that guy. Uh, he's very selective in the information he gives. Everything feels like an interrogation. I'm going to just call him Cecile. I uh, already had a lot on his plate since the guardians were murdered. Then my dad turned turn face and now there's another alien threatening earth i can't blame the guy for being careful i have no idea how he plans ahead with all these moving parts does he know as much as he acts like he does you should you sound impressed uh we'll go with this one his people really admire him i talked to an admin guy while i was in the gda hospital he was telling me how they discovered a guard was going to sell GDA secrets to a gang. So Cecile started funnel funneling the guard dummy intel. A few more sketchy meetings at the warehouse on the edge of town and their crime ring will crumble in from the inside. The way the dude was gushing, I could have sworn he had a crush on Cecile. Ew, that admin guy seems pretty loose-lipped. You heard all that in recovery? The guy had just had just had surgery, blamed it on the painkillers. Hmm. If I want access to Cecil er, to Universal without Cecile's permission, maybe I could talk to the rogue guard when he's on his own. Uh you look like you're thinking really hard about this. Should I have not said that? 
whatever you're planning, and I know I can't stop you since I can't leave the house. Going up against the sill would be risky. Yeah, whatever you decide, be careful, okay? I know, I know I won't get myself arrested by the GDA, let someone else, some unknown civilization starve, let Universal turn Earth into a battery, uh, let some unknown universe, universe, civilization starve. Thanks for worrying, I'll be okay though. It's not like I haven't escaped a... She's escaped a prison before? I think I need to watch the show because there's so much information I have no clue. Uh, I don't want to piss Cecile off either. Uh, escaped prison before. Apparently we've escaped prison before. Wait, what? I That's what I said. It's a long story. Uh, he's got time. I'll tell you about it sometime when the threat of an alien destroying Earth isn't looming on the horizon. You gotta tell him now, because you never know when you're gonna lose someone. Uh Uh-huh. For a second there, I wasn't sure you were talking about Universal or my dad. (sighs) There's an awkward pause. I really should not be involved in this conversation. Thanks for your advice. Anything else happened while I was out? Oh. Uh, I got in a fight with my ex-boyfriend. Say that again. I got in a fight with my ex-boyfriend. It's hard to explain. Rex came to apologize. At least I think that's what he meant to do. But then he reached for the explosives. What? Not to attack me, he wanted to block a door that I wanted to leave through. Sounds controlling. So, I fought him off, sort of. I don't know if you can call that a a fight. Who won? I won. Me, mm, him, no one. I kicked his butt. He thought he could tell me what to do, and he was wrong. You weren't hurt? Not really. We know each other's moves pretty well. Maybe we were holding back. I was punching him in the face, so we know each other's moves pretty well. There was a lot of dodging. It was annoying. It was sad. It was annoying. I just want him to leave me alone. Do you think there are unresolved feelings there from the breakup? He's the one that chose to cheat on me. Maybe for him... Definitely not. Uh, no. We were through the second I saw him with Kate. Besides, I might have feelings for someone else now. He sits up a little higher. Oh. I mean, oh. Is he flirting back? Should I, like, tell him I like him? We should tell him we like him. What if he's planning to get back with Amber? No! and I just embarrassed myself. So, anyway, what were we talking about? (laughs) Oh, um, right. You are going to tell me more... You are going to tell me more, you... stuff to take my mind off of being stuck on the couch. We can't tell him we like him? Ugh. I hung out with Amber and William. Oh, really? I didn't know you were close. Well, there's this friend we all care a lot about, who we thought might die, so we got to talking more. But I don't know, normal friends are hard. How do you do it? I spent most of my life normal. Until you, until you. I didn't have any other kind of friends than normal. I guess I just have normal friends normally. I don't think I'll ever be able to do it. Maybe I just have to keep trying. Maybe it's just not Amber and William for me. I think I'll just have to keep trying. No? What? I don't believe that make an effort stuff. That's your parents talking. That's people like Hills. I... You are making an effort. Are you making an effort with me? Wait, don't answer that. I'd be so mad if you said yes. 
No, I'm not. I'm not easygoing. All, all people take... I love hanging out with you. I'm glad we agree on that. I mean, that I love hanging out with you too. Not that I love hanging out with me. Yep, I got it. I think I should warn you, William was asking a lot of questions about your absences. Oh, I know. He's been drilling me about the gas explosion. Bunny, bunny? Bunny quotes around gas explosion. How did you know that? Amber, when we hung out, she kept, was asking the same questions. She has suspicions about you. I know. She's been really worried. I know she still cares, even if things didn't work out between us. I'll talk to her and William. I thought about it, and Invincible is only going to get harder and harder to hide. The GDA is going to be asking me to step up more and take on bigger missions. Helping out with an open house won't cover it. Exactly, and I think Japantown is running out of I'm sorry cheesecakes. You'll tell Amber even though you broke up? Are there still feelings there? No, I think we're better as friends. As we, is it weird to is it weird to feel okay with that? No, I'm happy to hear it. Not weird at all. Does it feel weird to you? I'm happy to hear it. Wait, don't come off as too happy. <laughs> but I did. But I did. Because you're a great guy and you deserve to feel um okay. Better than okay, I mean. Wow. Thanks. I want that for you too. Or more than that. <laughs> um is this it? Do I tell him I like him? We're both single. He's not getting back together with Amber. I'm definitely done with Rex. I think there's a vibe. Mark, I maybe have feelings for you. I like you. What am I doing? It's better to stay friends. I like you. I didn't want to say anything while you were dating Amber. There's a long pause where he looks kind of dumbstruck. Mark? What have I done if he doesn't speak soon? Finally, he speaks. I couldn't get a read on how you felt, but I feel the same way. He hesitates. Just to be clear, this is new. I wouldn't have hurt Amber. And even Rex. Same. That's why I didn't say anything. I know, I wouldn't have wanted you to. He takes my hand in his hand. Uh, This time, there's no mistaking it for a friendly gesture. So, uh, what now? Maybe I just move in closer to him. Can I kiss you? I'll kiss him. Oh. Oh, I really want to kiss him. Uh, is this gonna turn backfire if I kiss him? He did almost die, you know. Let's let's see how he takes it. I lean in closer to him. Eve, that's when his mom comes back in. No. Oh, uh. <laughs> Oh, thanks for helping me adjust my pillow, Eve. No problem. I forgot what I came in here for. Sorry. Thanks for ruining the moment. I wasn't trying to hit on your son or anything. She leaves, and the moment is completely destroyed. I straighten myself out, and Mark sits up on the sofa. You know what? I should probably just go. Oh, really? Uh, 
Yeah, you know. Right, the whole staff thing. Yeah. Wait. He takes my hand. I scan the room. No signs of his mom. Kiss him? Lean in for a hug. I've changed my mind and I want to be his friend. I just want to kiss him. I go back to, he did almost die. Uh, as soon as I start to lean in, he pulls me towards him. <gasps> we kiss him! Who's kissing who? We melt into one another. Why didn't I expect it to be this good? The sound of the door opening somewhere in the house sends us flying apart. Uh, yep, okay, leaving now. I'm on my way to the door when his mom appears. Um, thanks for having me over. Okay. Uh, bye Eve, call me and let me know how the, um, thing goes. Bye Mark, bye Miss Grayson. I run out there and starts and take straight to the sky. I fly out of there in a series of spirals and loops. I just need a second to think. I go home to my tree. Okay, think fast and then get on, on with it. I kiss Mark! What do I do with universal staff? I kiss Mark! I do a really fast happy dance around the room. Wait, does this mean we're dating now? We didn't really talk after. Is that what I want? Is that what he wants? We're definitely dating. Did I make a huge mistake? We'll be friends no matter what. We'll talk about it later. Um, I guess we should talk about it. We'll I'll talk about it later. I need to focus. I have to do something about Universal Staff of Leadership. But either way, I'm going to have to go back to that jail. If I want to sneak in, that shady guard Mark mentioned might be able to tell me how. I don't know what's going to happen at that prison. If I want to scream to get my strength up or talk to GDA's guard, I better do it before I go. I look at my map and consider my next step. I don't scream anymore because that's what that stupid girl Kate did. Uh, maybe the GDA guard, Mark Minchin, can tell me something useful. Let's do that. Using Invincible's intel, I head to the warehouse to talk to the rogue GDA guard. Sure enough, I spot him laughing with the gang members instead of surveying him. I land quietly. I can't read it because the game bar blocks that. Welcome aboard, man. The boss is looking forward to working with you. The guard unclips his access pass from his belt. Something hands it to the guy. Likewise, I've had it working for those GDA snobs. All we do is stand around. Yes, director stepman, and no, director stepman. I want in on the action. Creep. If you want in on the action, I can fix that. Atomic Eve, oh crap. He ducks around the corner. Hand that over. What'll it cost for you to keep this quiet? I can't be bought. Have it your way. Wait, you could just give us the key card. Shields up. Uh, let's try punching you in the face first. Oh, he countered! Um, let's try punching him in the face again. Oh, I should glue him. I'm stupid. GDA issued 20 times the standard voltage. Shields up. Is that all I can do? Can I raise my shield even higher? I can. Uh, what do I do? I don't have any moves. Uh, do I hit B?
Great, I've been dazed. I guess we'll just shield up. Oh, it only goes up to 30, I guess. Ooh, counter. Okay, let's glue you. Let's see if he can handle this. Oh, he can dodge my glue, really? Ah, I you that time. Whatever, my suit absorbs the impact. Man. Uh, shields up. Let's see. Oh, that's a higher hit. Maybe we should do this. This is a lot of hit. Dang, that was really good. I'm surprised the GDA doesn't inspire more loyalty. The pay's crap and the job's boring. Why do I want to be loyal to that? I bet Super's enjoying beating people up. You know what they say, find a job you love. Oh. I guess I have to let go of my turn because my shield's as big as mine can be. Scared of a little hit? Oh, I can only shield up? Skip. You know, I should probably upgrade my stuff since he's pretty powerful. Um. Oops. What's this stuff here? Uh, release a perfume cloud significantly reduces range weapons accuracy. Uh, what's this? Uh, gain energy, something critical. Uh, when Atomic Eve has something a chance to dodge is double. Dodging is good. Critical hit. How much is... Oops. Um, how many points does this cost? Oh, it's another evade. And what's this fire ability? Oop, 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 oop. Come on. No. Uh, damage up. Um, maybe we should evade. Can we get this evade? Ah, no, I was trying to use points. Oh, we can't do it unless it's highlighted in yellow. Uh, let's see. Uh, gain energy. Uh, let's do a higher, oop, a higher attack. Hello. Hello. Uh... Bathe your enemies and a wave damage can't be dodged. Can't be dodged is good. Uh, ooh, how more health points? And I'm out of points. Okay. And let's try that. Oh, takes six energy though. Uh, this has a lot of attack points. Oh, let's glue him. Bet the GDA didn't train you for that. And, oh, was that the one? That wasn't the one I wanted to use. I wanted to use the ray. Shut up. We want to use this one. Invigorating, huh? We need to glue him. Why is it any time? Okay. We gotta skip. Why is it any time it's his turn? I can only shield up. Why can my shield only go up to 30? Shield up. Let's glue you down. And then we'll do this one. Some more. How did the director know I was jumping ship? Seal doesn't know. I'm here on my own behalf. You could just give me the key card and we wouldn't have to fight. Sparks fly. Why am I still dazed? 
Oh, my shield was... That was dumb. My shield was up. Dang, man. Shields all the way up. Uh, shield all the way up. Need to glue you. And this one. Uh. Dang, that's pretty tough attack. We're getting close to killing him, though. Uh, aren't the good guys supposed to hold back? You wanted in on the action, didn't you? Can't move. Man, being day sucks. All I can do is shield up. Ooh, I got a counter! All right. Shield. Oh, my shield was up. That was stupid. Glue you down. Pain in the butt. Uh, this one. He's almost gone. Shields up. That's... Is that enough? No, uh, a little more. Gotcha. After defeating the, the defeating blow, I glue him to the floor. Fine, take my pass and frick off. I'll take his badge to Cecile, or I can use it to get a, to get the staff to, back to Universal first. I grab from his pocket. Thanks. Pleasure doing business with you. Got any tips for getting into the jail? Oh, that's a special ability one. Let's say that. I can put in a good word for you. Mm. There's a prisoner in there, alien, green. How do we get to her cell? Urgh. I could put in a bad word for you too. I could chase you down, down your new colleague if you want. I could put in a bad word for you too. Fine. Use the badge on the turn style, then go right. You'll find the alien chick if you keep going. Thank you. I think they'll give me a probation, maybe. If I see you again, I'll toss a muffin into your chest cell. <laughs> oh, that's, that's kind of funny. I alert Cecile to come and collect his goon. Prison. Uh... I could vent a little to come and wait to what my power? I don't know. I don't like to yell anymore because it's a stupid traitor girl doing my boyfriend while getting me to yell at the park. So I don't want to do that. So we're going to go to prison. I head over to the prison. I enter the same non-script lobby and pass the same first set of guards as before. I must be on the list because they gave me clearance to pass through to the next hall into another identical waiting area. This is my point of no return. Not that it looks like much, but I can't hesitate. If I'm going to take the staff to Universal, I need to make my move before Cecilia's guard arrive to re greet me. I probably have 25 seconds. I have that guard's ID badge. That should get me close to the cell block. I know to turn right, then left after using the badge. I have some good advantages on my side. I want to get to, to Universal. It's still risky. I'd be helping the whole planet. I do not want to do that. It's kind of risky, but um, um, we'll be helping a planet, I hope. I believe Universal when she says she, her people will starve if I don't... Uh, I just don't know what she'll do to Earth. Still, I have to have faith that I can handle whatever it is. So, who do I trust here? 
Well, I don't trust that old guy, so I guess we're trusting Universal. Cecile sounds like he wants to be different, but he still works for the government. Oh, I definitely trust Universal more than... Universal's a bit like me. She'll do anything for her people. If I can help her out, I can make sure she doesn't wreck Earth in the process. My decision is final. I'm taking the staff to seal. I'm taking the staff to Universa. I quickly scan each hallway to make sure no one's coming. There's no way, there's, nah, there's no way to hide from the camera, so I have to go fast. Was it left or right from here? Oh... Oh, I follow the leftmost hallway until it reaches split. On my left, there is a hall that looks, uh, I think I picked the wrong way. On my left, there's another hall, just like the one I'm standing in. Ahead of me is a floor to the ceiling turnstile with an electric bag re badge reader. I bet the guard's ID works here. Uh, I'm glad I had it with me. I'll go, go through the turnstile. I swipe the badge, the guard's badge, and the turnstile lets me go through like it knows me. That was almost too easy. This hallway splits off in two different directions. Now this way's right. Right? That guard told me to turn right after using his badge. I'll go right, I'll turn right. Now I can see that we're close to a cell block. If I just gun it, I got a trophy jailbreaker. But I don't even need to... Next thing I know... Oh crap! The death compels me. My power is restored. Now you will face the retribution of war. Oh no! Oh no! Come on, Universal! I took your side! Her connection to that staff is magnetic. Her combination, or combined power was too much for this place. Before I can proceed, process what happened, she's gone and so is the staff. Dang it. <laughs> Cecilia and his guards appear at a run. Atomic Eve, what in God's name were you thinking? I was thinking about her starving people. I thought I could trust her. I've seen what happens to people in places like this. I thought the GDA facility would contain her. I was thinking about her starving people. You don't even know if those starving people are real. I, I can fix it. An alien being just reconnected with the source and con conduct of unknowable devastating power. Escaped with, escaped what was a highly regarded cont containment facility, and declare war on the planet. I respect your powers and applaud your innovation, but you're in over your head. You're not interested in joining the Guardians of the Globe, so it's just you and your empathy. It's not enough. The risks are too great. Enjoy forces. I can recruit people. I promise I'll cooperate. I'm not going to cooperate with him. Um, maybe I'll recruit people. You're not hearing me. It's too late for, for that. No offense, but you had your chance. You should have told us what was going on and told us something more. You want us to, to take her in, Stedman? No. I can't let that happen. I had to escape... Uh, I'll run. Without waiting for a response, I book it out of there. The guards catch up with me. No, please. Relax, we're not arresting you. Oh, was I? Did my previous Let's Play, I give them robot voices? I think so. They escort me out of the... What? They escort me the rest of the way out. Why? Why aren't they uh, walking me away? I fly away from there with the, just one th thought in my mind. No matter what Cecile's plans are, I need to prepare. Why didn't they arrest us? I know I'm not the only one getting ready. Oh, press A. 
To be continued. Oh my goodness. To be continued. No. Thanks for watching. Maybe you'll watch more. Maybe the video on the left. Maybe the video on the right. If you're on a mobile device and you don't see any videos on the screen, it's in the description.